First time I heard National Open Choir, I uh, was moved by the sound and message. I feel blessed to be a part of the uplifting beauty that the choir creates and shares with the audience. The music has always been the thing that brings me closer to God, and I have deeply felt that being in the National Lutheran Choir. It opens me windows into the presence of God when we sing with other people and with each other. It gives me hope, it gives me life. When I sing, I feel like I'm being the person God wants me to be, the person that God needs me to be. Spirituality is a key component of the National Lutheran Choir. That allows me, as a musician and a Lutheran, to live a more fully integrated life. The fact that people come, that we open our hearts and share that, and make music that astonishingly draws us closer to God and to each other and to those who hear us. It gives me life in ways that I don't find in other places always. Under the direction of nationally recognized conductor, composer, and organist, Dr. David Cherwin, the 64-member National Lutheran Choir's artistry is rooted in its mission to strengthen, renew, and preserve the heritage of sacred choral music. The National Lutheran Choir has shared its music with the world in concert and service since 1986, with 30 recordings of hymns, choral classics, contemporary works, spirituals, and major new works commissioned by the choir. The choir is eager to celebrate the rich heritage of sacred music with our friends in the Pacific Northwest. On September 29th and 30th, the choir will lead community singing events featuring a massed choir of local church singers in Seattle and Portland. Additional tour stops include Tacoma, Washington and Salem, Oregon. I'm excited to sing this new music and bring it to new audiences. When we feel the Holy Spirit in us, we're bringing that word to the people. Perhaps this year of the 500th anniversary might be the beginning of a new time between Lutherans and Catholics and really Christians around the world to understand what connects us as opposed to what divides us. And I'm excited to see how this music and the places where we're going to sing it and the people with whom we will sing it will maybe be a part of that conversation and that invitation. <laughs>